Hello dear friends, welcome back to your favorite channel, where we bring you trending and interesting news from around the world. May I quickly encourage you to please subscribe to this channel if you are yet to subscribe. Please kindly hit the bell icon so you can get notification whenever we post new stories. Endeavor to share these new stories with your friends, family, relations and loved ones. So you can get notification whenever we post new stories. Thank you so much, guys. I appreciate your support. Breaking news. Popular pastor, world-renowned, is dead. The renowned South Korean pastor, Dr. David Yonggi Cho, also known as Paul Yonggi Cho, has passed away at the age of 85. Yonggi Cho was reported to have died in the early hours of September 14, 2020. As of the time of publishing this report, the cause of his death is unknown. As no official statement has been released by the family or the church leadership. Dr. Yonggi Cho is perceived to have a simple lifestyle and spends much of his resources on social welfare. According to Kong He, he said, at 7.13 a.m. this morning, my pastor and spiritual father, Dr. Yonggi Cho, 1936 to 2021, just went home to the presence of our Lord Jesus Christ. I love you, Dr. Cho. Founder and senior pastor of City Harvest Church, Kong He, confirmed the passing of Dr. David Yonggi Cho through a post he made on his official Facebook page on Tuesday. Reacting to Dr. Yonggi Cho's death, Nigerian televangelist Apostle Johnson Suleiman took to his official Twitter page on Tuesday to pen down his heart tribute to the late gospel preacher, describing him as someone who affected his life in the prayer dimension. In the early 90s, you affected my life in the prayer dimension. You made Korea a nation for spiritual pilgrimage. You affected ministers of God in no small measure. A general sleeps. Good night, Dr. Yonggi Cho. Rest in peace. Apostle Suleiman wrote early this morning. Nigerian Christians on Apostle Suleiman's timeline also expressed their, sad their sadness to the demise of the Asian pastor, who was reported to have some time ago held the record of the largest congregation or the largest church building in the world. It is sad and unfortunate that um, the re world-renowned um, Dr. Yonggi Cho is dead. Those in the Christian faith and even much more around the world would attest to the fact that the man had made history. It is a very, very saddened situation as it is. As at the time of filing this report, the course of his death could not be ascertained as there has not been any official report or release from his family or from the leadership of the church.
but however it is really really a certain one for the church across the world what could have led to his death could it have been the issue of uh, the coronavirus could he have been that it was a natural death could it have been that something happened well as said nobody can tell but we keep our fingers crossed to see how things unfold there should be um, a report to let the world and his followers know exactly what happened and uh, what the cause of his um, death or what led to his death as it is as questions will definitely be asked you know christians around the world would want to know exactly what happened don't forget that while in this part of the world in africa a lot of people are still trying to recover from the death of the world-renowned prophet tb joshua who died just um uh few weeks ago or some weeks ago rather and uh, it is very really unfair to you know a lot of people who believed in their you know um, in the in the powers and the what God have been doing through these men of God what uh, a spiritual loss what a physical loss to the world to every nation of the world on this particular is a situation what are your thoughts guys concerning it what could be going on generals champions are leaving or are being called home according to what we are hearing It is sad and unfortunate. What are your thoughts, guys? Please drop by at the comment section. Let's know what your thoughts are on this particular news story as it were. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you are yet to subscribe. Please kindly hit the bell icon so you can get notification whenever we post news stories. Endeavor to share these new stories with your friends, family, relations, and loved ones so they can get to know what is happening around the world and be informed. Thank you so much, guys. I appreciate your support. And I'll see you guys on the other news. Thank you and bye for now.